What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Double M Motorsports. Today we're gonna start reassembling everything, getting the body back on. Uh, that way we can get the firewall installed, electrical done, interior put in, all that kind of stuff. So uh, first thing I'm gonna do is get the car rolled out and rinse it off. All this, uh, all this painting and sanding and all that stuff in there has got the car pretty dusty. So we're gonna get it rinsed off and uh, start putting some some parts back on the car making it look like a car again so stick around enjoy the episode That is going to be all she wrote for the day today. Got quite a bit done. Um, body's back on and mounted. I've started loosely mounting fenders and stuff. I've still got to hard mount the door. I've got to trim out for the for the hinges down there. Everything's still kind of it's kind of tweaked a little bit. So uh, 
when you put the body back on, you just gotta, I mean, you can see how, how different the, the gaps are. And it was like that before too. These things, you know, you be uh, tweak them, then you, you do fiberglass work. And if you don't do the fiberglass work perfect, then everything goes back just a little bit off, but that's okay. It's just a race car. It's not a show car. Um, got the grill loosely sitting on there, trying to figure out where that's supposed to mount. I picked up the uh, this L channel here, L bracket uh, with holes in it. And that's gonna be what I use to mount the oil cooler on. So I'm trying to kind of get everything figured out here as far as spacing where that goes, where the grill needs to be at to be nice and vertical. And then I still have to chop the frame rails off down here to their required length. Um, and then drill the holes and stuff for the bumper and drill all the holes to mount this stuff. So still got that stuff to do. I've got the electrical to do. My crimpers are in Monet. Uh, the modified's down there. The modified's down in Monet getting the, uh, we've been working on it and I haven't been showing anything because I'm trying to learn on it. So I have no clue what I'm doing on those modifieds and it's in somebody else's shop. It's in Kelly's shop. So um, I may film a little update on it, but until I'm comfortable with that thing, I probably won't do a lot of filming on how to's and stuff like that, but I'll give you an update on it. Maybe Tuesday night, I'm going back down there to work on it. So, um, Fenders and stuff are on loosely because I've still got to, I've still got to mount the headers all the way, but I want to make sure I get the oil lines, have room to mount the oil lines uh, before I do that. Um, interior is somewhat put back together. The back plate is completely done. Uh, the tunnel, I've still got to rivet it in. Um, all my drill bits are down there in Monet too, at Monet and Aurora. So. Uh, I didn't have but one little tiny drill bit or two and I broke both of them. So anywho, all this stuff's just loosely mounted because I've got to drill some new holes and still got to drill some rivets out, which you can see over there. Um, I've got to, this is the worst panel of them all. And I did, remember I rebuilt this out. This is cracked there. And because of how I had it sitting on the table, some of the, some of the cracks came back, which sucks but it is what it is uh this side had a lot of work done to it this was all rebuilt all the way up through here uh you can see the <laughs> you can see the areas of imperfection there uh this was attempted to be fixed this was attempted to be fixed and so this panel's gonna have to be it's gonna be quite a bit off i'm gonna have to kind of come in there with my little uh i call it the zipper oscillating saw <laughs> and and just try to line the body line up as best I can and then try to cut uh, a gap over here to where it looks somewhat reasonable. Um, <clears throat> so I gotta get that put on there. Um, what else did I get done? I uh, got the tire over here, got it mounted on its rim. So this thing's sitting on four wheels again, got the Nerf bar in. And the uprights, I've got to drill a hole through the through the fiberglass body there uh, to get those uprights bolted in. But uh, other than that, that successfully completed my goal of getting stuff off of that side of the garage so I can get the wife's car back in there. So she will be happy. I can stack all this stuff back on this side and uh, get her car back in for the night so she'll be happy hope trunk lids on there but uh she's starting to come back together again finally but uh we will probably i'll see how long this footage is if it's long enough i'll i'll go ahead and drop the video if not uh we'll catch you next time